Sure. Uh, my name is Sarah Belanger, and I am a recent graduate of Faculty of Land and Food Systems, and I'm a friend of the farm, and I'm very honored to be a staff member at the UBC Farm. Um, one thing that has been running through my mind during this whole process is I'd really love to be able to give all the Board of Governors and everybody who gets to make this final decision and everybody a copy of, I believe it's a short history of progress or is a brief history of progress? Brief. The Ronald Wright book that came out recently? Short history of progress. Okay, in, in one sentence, that book is describing decisions that have been made by cultures throughout time that led to their demise. And I feel like this is one of those decisions that in, in the past, some of those decisions we can forgive humanity because of our ignorance. And this is an opportunity where, and it's particularly poignant because it's happening at a university where we purport to be the leaders of sustainability and the leaders of innovation, and where we're teaching our students critical thinking and sustainability. I hear that word all the time here. Um, and I don't think a decision that paves over or in any way downsizes or moves the last working farm in Vancouver, where over 100 programs are running, where so many people are getting to come and bring their children and learn in a hands, head, heart sort of way about sustainability and food systems. Joe Scott, I'd really like your eye contact right now. Thank you. Um, any sort of decision that does that really does not meet up to the statement that UBC is a leader in sustainability. And at the end of the day, I loved my degree here and I love so much of what happens at UBC, but I want to be proud of my degree. Hold my hand, I'm going to cry. And it's not because I'm emotional. As a woman. No. This, this community is an amazing place. And the education that happens here is amazing. <laughs> but I want to hang up my degree and be proud of it. I want to be proud of UBC, and right now, you can do better than this. I want to see that fourth option. I don't want to see unpaid people having to do the work to make that fourth op option happen. I want to see the people who are being paid good money listen to the voices that have been expressed for years, not just in this phase four. And I want to see option four coming from a university that I want to be proud of. Excellent. Make me proud of. <laughs>